There we go. There's the jab. Why do they turn into babies? What the fuck? Hello, welcome back to the Spanless Game, where I'm playing every Super Nintendo game in order of release. And I have three games today. I have Steel Talions, Tecmo Super Bowl, and Super Putty. And our first game today is Steel Talions, from whoever that is. And the back of the box seems to be a helicopter game. The Army has Green Berets, the Navy has their SEALs, but for chopper pilots, there's only one uh, the best quality for Steel Talions. Proves you got the right stuff, annihilate tanks, choppers, Missiles and more. Dogfight jet fighter fly between canyon walls close enough to touch. It's gut check time. Through 14 combat missions in fog, haze, smoke, darkness over des desert, woodlands, and mountains. Pilot the most advanced chopper taxpayer money can buy. Fire the most destructive weaponry in the air. Laser guided missiles and pinpoint accuracy or deadly 30 millimeter cannon. But you could just scrap metal unless you've got what it takes to be a steel turn. from left field. Whoever that is. Let's play the game. Left Field Entertainment. I'm glad it takes up the full screen. Okay. Second player, no. Speed set, no. Real mode, no. Stuff. Yeah. Sounds good. Mission one. Okay. There, that's how I go higher. Oh, this game is this this game is ugly. You know, Pilot Wings was a launch title and looked better than this. Ah. Oh, they went away. Turn. Turn. I destroyed a thing. Oh, take this, you pyramid. Yeah. Oh, damn, it's lost fuel. No. Oh, oh collision. Boy, this is shitty looking. Yeah, I've seen enough of that. Graphics, uh, we're going to give those a two. Sound, and that's going to get a three and a half. Music, there really is nothing going on there. And what I heard was shitty. One story, uh, I guess a half of one, sure. It's just typical, go destroy stuff. Controls, oh, we'll give that a four. It's not that great. Uh, funness, a... Uh, Hmm, half a one. Does it hold my attention? No, and overall it's going to get a... Oh, two might be generous. Uh, we'll give it a one and a half. That was Steel Talions, one of the worst looking games I played on the Super Nintendo. Let's see what's next. Our next game is Tecmo Super Bowl. Tecmo Super Bowl. Choose your team from the 28 NFL teams. Can you get to the Super Bowl? Probably not. Grr, mean football guy, grr. Back of the box. It's fun. It's competitive. It's real football. Tecmo Super Bowl is unquestionably the best football game you'll ever play. Why am I yelling in all caps? I don't know. Use your favorite NFL team, the real NFL players, and your football skills to challenge the ultimate in football. Use your knowledge of football and gameplay skills to your favorite NFL team of real NFL players. Do the Super Bowl see football season and win the Super Bowl. If the Super Nintendo version of the most successful football game ever made, blah, blah, blah. Let's play the game. The Quick Bunny Rabbit presents Tecmo. Whatever happened to Tecmo? Do they still make games? And they make like the Ninja Gaiden like re uh, reboot for the Xbox. It's kind of the last thing I remember from them. Dead or Alive, I think that's them. Hey! I 
Okay. Can, 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 there we go. Yes, the sound. So nostalgic. Let's do a preseason game. Man versus computer. That'll be my Cleveland Browns. And we'll, we'll go up against the uh, Denver, uh, Seattle, or the uh, Giants. Please select the weather. Oh, let's push the SNES to its limits. Let's play in snow. Preseason. Meaningless game. The Cleveland Browns versus the New York Gi Football Giants. And I don't know what just happened, but apparently I'm getting the ball. Medcalf. Okay, 20 yard return. This is how you make a football game, people. Not stupidly complicated like modern football games. Oh, incomplete pass. I, I kind of forgot what play I picked. Uh, let's do that thing. I'm going to run it. Red 24. Red 24. Put. Yeah, first down. First down. It's fast, it's quick, it's responsive. There's not just so many menus and things you don't know what the hell you're doing. I mean, it may not be like quote unquote a simulation, but who cares? It's fun. Yes! Protect me, players. Ah, oh, the zigzag move. Yes! Touchdown! I touched the down! Celebration. Brian Ginchin. Bernie Kazar. I know it's Bony Bernie Kosar. I was a Browns fan of this era. Good. Okay, I could play this for a while. Graphics. Okay, they're not the prettiest graphics in the world. I'll give it that. I'll give it a five. Um, and a half. Cut screens make it a little bit better. Sound, uh, it's nostalgic sound effects and stuff. I'm going to give that a seven and a half. Music, we're going to give that an eight. Story, it's football, there's no story. Controls, uh, we'll give that a nine. Funness, we're going to give that an eight. Does it hold my attention? An eight. And overall, it's going to get an eight. That was Tecmo Super Bowl. Maybe the best su uh, football game on the Super Nintendo. Coming at you, Madden. All right, let's see what's next. Our final game today is called Super Putty. And the box art looks like this. Apparently you're a blue blob of buddy and you're, you punch other things, including a pig, a balloon, and a sausage. Cool. My kind of game. Not since the Atari 2600 had there been games. So weird. You're putty, the toughest ball of blue goo the galaxy has ever seen to keep your pliable pals from turning into chewing gum. You have to bounce, bash, squash, and stretch yourself through the weirdest, wildest cartoon universe ever. Keep a blue eye open for the dastardly dazzled days and dweezil their nasties nightmare a blob of putty ever had. I feel like I might have played this on another system, maybe? Or there's something similar? System 3 presents... Yeah. Maybe I didn't play this. The name sounded familiar and the concept kind of sounds familiar, but none of this looks familiar. No, I did not play this. Stretch. How do I stretch? I feel like I'm supposed to do there. Ah, okay, there we go. Bounce. Is that just jump? I know I jab, 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 jab. Oh, that's just stretching again. 
Uh, there we go. There's the jab. Why do they turn into babies? What the fuck? What just happened? Oh, I don't like that. So, so to punch, it's the uh, R and L bumper. R goes left or right, and L goes left. That's not very good. Why do they turn into babies? You know, conceptually, I liked this. And when I first saw it and saw kind of saw the premise, I thought maybe this will be a good game. Controls are really letting us down. What the hell is even happening? Inflate. Why? I... I don't know. Graphics! Uh, we'll give those a uh, 4. Sound, a uh, 4. Music, a 3 and a half. Story, no idea. A 1. Controls, a 2 and a half. Funness, oh, 2 and a half. Conceptually, though, it does hold my attention. It's just not well executed. From my point of view, and overall it's going to get a 3 that was super putty. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next game.